We have to realize that these are very evolved civilizations, establishing a way of life that impressed even those who destroyed it. So Mexico City is built on, on top of the ancient city of Tenochtitlan. It was selected for obvious reasons. It was the capital of the empire. And it had a wonderful foundation. You don't have to do that much. You just destroy and build on top of it. So on top of the great temple, what do you have? The great basilica. If you conquer a land, you want to rebuild it in your image. And you can see that because that's the reason why they call Mexico the new Spain. They wanted to recreate Spain except that the, the indigenous people were going nowhere fast. You don't want to remove the site of sacredness. You build there. So since people are used to go to that place, well, they will go to the new God. The foundations are the indigenous foundations. So that tells you something, that you can never erase a culture totally. You can destroy the external part of it, the cities. You can destroy the codices. But what you cannot destroy is the resilience of the human spirit. Much of that knowledge did not go underground, it went into memory. It was committed to memory, it was committed to the heart.